starts now. Good evening, everyone. I'm Chad Mira. And I'm Lauren Kolber. Thanks for watching KX News. By this time tomorrow night, you'll be hearing election night results right here on KX News. That's right. Tomorrow night, a Tuesday night. Mm -hmm. Have you ever wondered why election day is always on a Tuesday? Well, in our top story tonight, KX News' reporter Sanji Milburn tells us how this day goes back to the earliest days of our nation. Long lines, stuffed ballot boxes, and proud citizens. It's already been a record-setting year for those casting their votes in the midterm elections. I'm really edgy. My, I seriously have a nervous tummy about, like, what all the results are going to be. I think it's... I'm ready. I'm ready for the uproar. I am. While many will be ready for campaign ads to end, it's also an important decision day as we send new leaders into office. You know, it's, uh, there's a lot of leaders we need stepping in. I mean, we're going to, we're voting people, we're voting measures and, you know, different laws and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's interesting to see how it all plays out. A lot of people don't vote, but they do have something to say. For those making their voice heard through a ballot, there's little need to mark the calendar. It's in the U.S. Constitution that Congress sets the time and place of elections, so they stipulated that the first Tuesday after the first Monday in November was to be the time to, as they put it, to choose electors. So we hold our elections on the first Tuesday after the first Monday in November in even-numbered years. According to the History Channel, Tuesday was the most convenient day. Back in the 1800s, most people worked as farmers and lived far from their polling place and needed time to travel, at least a day. Wednesday was market day for farmers, and weekends, most people spent Sundays in church. Reporting in Bismarck, Sanji Milburn, KX News. Be sure to tune in tomorrow. We are your local election headquarters, and we'll have all the results for you. Plus, you can get up-to-the-minute results with your KX News app. So will snow in the forecast tomorrow affect voters?